This tutorial forms part of our basic computer training course for beginners and will cover elements 8.1, 8.2 and 8.3 for those looking to qualify in the European Computer Driving Licence. The lesson is about email. Email is short for electronic mail and is a digital messaging service using the internet. Email is now so common and widespread that for many businesses email is their main form of communication. Anyone can get an email address and there are two main ways for home users to set up an email address. That's either through your internet service provider ISP or on the World Wide Web opening an account with one of the many webmail companies such as Hotmail, Google or Yahoo. With an internet provider you will generally need an email client to provide the software enabling your email use so that you can view, send and receive emails. Webmail the software is hosted on the web. We'll take a look at email clients and webmail in the next tutorial. So let's take a look at the makeup and the structure of an email address. The first one we're going to take a look at is an internet provider email account and your email address is made up of your name and then at the internet provider that you use for example if you're Joe Bloggs and you're using AOL as your internet provider you'll be able to get an email address of Joe Bloggs now it won't be Joe Bloggs because there's probably a number of Joe Bloggs that use AOL you will probably get Joe Bloggs and a number for this demonstration we've used joeblogs1 so your email address will be joeblogs and then we have this squiggly at aol.com because AOL is the provider and if BT Internet is your provider it would be joeblogs1 at btinternet.com now there are no spaces in your email address so it will be written joeblogs1 at btinternet.com as all one word. Webmail creates an account just as similar so it will be joeblogs1 at gmail.com if you're using Google Gmail or joeblogs1 at hotmail.com again all one word. So that's the makeup of your email address and once you've got an email address you can start sending and receiving emails over the internet. Thanks very much.